literally do feel like a little slicked wet rat, right? <laughs> Welcome to my productive morning routine. I wanted to do this video with going back in a fall because I feel like we're all getting back into that routine mindset. Some of us are going back to school or just getting like a new revamped feeling for work. I obviously don't go to the beach every morning, but I do love doing some type of like activity or waking up with the sun. So whether that is going on a sunrise walk, going to the beach, or even just like opening up your window or going and sitting on your front porch, I think it's so nice to wake up with the world. So this morning, I'm going to sunrise. Super successful sunrise swim. I don't think anything in the world quite wakes you up like dunking in salt water. I literally do feel like a little slicked wet rat, right? Normally I make my coffee at home, but I'm kind of in the mood since I'm already out to go and pick up a coffee. I'm trying to decide if I want to go to like a coffee shop or just do like a Starbucks drive through We're gonna go to a coffee shop. <laughs> That was so nice. I ended up being able to like finish the devotion that I had started on the beach. And it was such a good passage. It was basically talking about how when you are Christian and have your faith in God, the first step is to like read the Bible and figure out things in your faith. And then the next step is that you have to almost allow God to change your heart to see it in a different way, to let it like actually change who you are. Anyway, it was just really good points and I'm glad I was able to finish it. Today's a Saturday, so it is nice that I can kind of take a little bit more time. Typically I just do coffee at home, but it's always fun to get a little something out. So now I've done my sunrise, gone to get coffee, finished my devotion, I'm feeling good. And I wanna go home. I'll probably eat just like a granola bar and then I wanna go to the gym and get a workout in. <laughs> not want to come but it always feels so good once I've like finished the workout so I have my water I'm gonna put my headphones in before I go it's been a little bit since I've been to the gym so I think I'm just gonna do it like a good stretch the treadmill and maybe do a little bit of legs I always feel like that feels really nice I'm just hoping that I can get a good workout in
all done at the gym. Um, I may never go on a Saturday morning again. It was so busy. Every machine that I got on, it was like, oh, how many sets do you have? Which is fine, but it was just like, I felt like I couldn't get on anything. So it was a shorter workout today. I don't follow like a super particular plan. I feel like I kind of bounce around, but today I did some legs just on the different machines, an ab circuit and did a couple sets of that and then finished with the 12, 330. So I'm feeling good. I am hungry and ready to go back for breakfast. I feel like it's a little obnoxious, but changing out my water glass makes me drink so much more water. And I have this cute little one from Anthropology. So I'm gonna sip on this while I make breakfast. It can be so difficult to prioritize eating good food, but I feel so much better when I start my day out with just a yummy breakfast. And this avocado was the perfect green, so that just made my morning. I do eggs and toast a lot of mornings, but if I want something quickly, I like doing a dairy-free yogurt bowl with some fruit or just toast with like butter and jam. But when I do spend the extra time making like a big yummy breakfast, I love it so much. And if you have a perfect avocado, you just have to make avocado toast. <laughs> absolute favorite things is when a workout lines up with your hair wash schedule and my hair desperately needs to be washed. So today is an everything shower, the hair wash, I'm shaving my legs, exfoliating the whole nine yards. I love mornings so much. I feel like that is when I hit my stride and especially when I wake up and I just choose to prioritize being productive. It sets up my whole day to feel so good. You obviously don't have to do like a major workout or a huge breakfast or any of these things every day. Making the conscious decision of shifting your focus over to being more productive or adding things into your routine that make you feel good is going to be such a game changer. <laughs> So good, I feel so fresh, so clean. And something about drinking this water out of the glass, distinguished. I've really tried to chill out with my skincare routine because I don't know if you can see here, but I've been breaking out quite a bit. And I think that's due to a lot of things. I need to change my pillowcase more. I need to eat better because dairy really impacts my skin. And I think life has just been a little bit stressful. So that kind of appears on my face, unfortunately. I've really been just doing a vitamin C and then moisturizer or sunscreen. I do love the Paula's Choice products. Also, I've been going back to my tried and true moisturizer and sunscreen. This is recommended from my dermatologist, the Elta MD I've been using when I was 15 years old and I was on Accutane. So this stuff is good. If you follow me on TikTok and Instagram this past week, we were actually hit by a hurricane. Thankfully, Josh in my house was completely fine, but some of our best friends, Rachel and Nate, were really impacted by that hurricane. We were under a mandatory evacuation and we all went to Orlando, Florida and actually stayed at Greta's house. But by the time we had come back, the lower level of their house had completely flooded and their whole street was so underwater that we had to actually kayak to their house. The past two or three days have been spent like doing a bunch of demo work. We had to rip up all the floors, do so much cleaning, so much of like, towels and moving furniture out and just lots of stuff. It's so eye-opening having that happen to people that we love and so close to home. It was five minutes away from our house. It puts things into perspective of how things are so easy to just be lost or ruined. And I'm just so thankful that everybody was safe and nobody was harmed in the process, but it still is so sad to see. As for life right now, I also announced on my other platforms that I recently signed with management. And if you're in the social media world, most people who work on social media have management. 
it. So it's just somebody to handle all of your emails and campaigns and negotiation, like all of that kind of stuff. But I went to school for PR and I don't know, I just really enjoyed doing that for the whole time I've been doing social media. I liked doing all that stuff. But I kind of got to this roadblock where I realized that the only way to continue growing and having balance in life is to start delegating. And my favorite thing that I do on here is making the content. So if I can have other people handle all of that stuff, then I can do more and kind of be more present in life as well. So nothing on here will change, but I'll just have more time to hopefully get videos out every week. We weren't going to post this week because like I said, it's been kind of a crazy chaotic time, but it's Saturday. So this video will be up tomorrow and I just did not want to miss a week. I love posting on here. I love talking to you guys. And we haven't done a morning routine in a while, so I figured that would be a fun one to kind of do instead of the normal weekly vlogs. Also, Coastline Color, the seashell jewelry that I always wear, just restocked, and they always sell out, so I'll link that in the description. I've been doing better about linking things because it's so nice when you're actually wanting something and the link is right there. I've been doing a lot on Like to Know It, like literally everything, skincare, makeup, different clothes that I'm wearing pretty much every day. And there's no pressure to literally ever buy anything. There's so much stuff out there that you have to really decide what's best for you but I only put it out there in case people are in the mood to shop and are looking for something it's nice to find a direct link I'm gonna finish up with some body butter but that is it for this week's video love you guys so much and I'll see you next week's video mm -hmm.